termites, um, you know, eat wood, of course, but they don't have a digestive system. Termites don't have digestive systems? Ay, caramba! Ay, chihuahua! Termites don't have digestive systems. Fucking hilarious. So, in which case, they can't digest the wood that they eat. So they have little critters inside of them. <laughs> that digest the wood for them. The termites can't live, live without the critters inside of them. The critters can't live without the termites. So, uh, which one evolved first? The correct answer is neither. And the other correct answer is Mormons. That's Mormons. Why can't um, animals reproduce other kinds of animals anymore? Define other kinds of animals. Phrase makes no sense. And why can't plants reproduce any other kind of plant but itself? Nobody said they could. We have dogs, you know, becoming dogs. We have cats becoming Yes, nobody says otherwise. And cats, and we have bananas staying the exact same way they've been since the beginning of time. So you're saying bananas existed 13.7 billion years ago, long before Earth existed. <sighs> now, this is question number three. You mean assertion number three, not question number three. You haven't asked any questions. All you've done is make idiotic assertions under the pretense of asking questions. And this is a scientific fact. You mean it's one of your assertions, not a scientific fact. That proves that evolution could have never happened. It is impossible to prove a observed natural phenomenon has never happened. This will test the Big Bang Theory as you know it. Cosmology has absolutely nothing to do with evolution nor evolutionary theory. There is something uh, that science has proven called the conservation of angular momentum. Angular momentum. I'm going to say that again. The conservation of angular momentum. That's angular momentum. Basically, you get two spinning objects or one spinning object. Please be more vague if possible. As the Big Bang Theory, you have one object spinning, or two objects spinning very, very fast. No, that has absolutely nothing at all to do with the Big Bang, nor the Big Bang Theory. It doesn't say that. Creating a Big Bang. No. They will separate out of each other, or separate from each other. No. However you want to put it. Going that same direction. No. You know, creating the universe. No. Creating the moons. No. As you think it did. No. And creating every single planet. No. So that's my third question for this video. You mean that's about your 30th assertion under the pretense of asking questions. You made a hell of a lot of assertions regarding what scientists don't actually state regarding what evolutionary theory doesn't actually state regarding what Big Bang cosmology does not actually state and you attribute all of those bullshit assertions to scientists who have not made them and will never make them and then you say your assertions are actually questions. Nobody, idiot, is falling for that bullshit. How does that make sense? Nobody claims that you are making sense, dude. If science itself... You mean you, not science or scientists. Disproves it. One cannot disprove an assertion that nobody makes. Why is it still considered science? Nobody claims that your assertions are science. Oh, God, that was awful. Oh, that's disgusting. I told you so. Nobody ever listens to me.